Hello, my name's John Wheeler and welcome to my channel. On my last video I did an assembly review on the rotary roller system by Orta. I also showed you a couple of little test pieces that I did. This was done on a piece of oak which is about 65mm in diameter together with something much smaller a 9mm pencil uh, showing its full capabilities. Yeah, I do an awful lot of pyrography and I wanted to incorporate the pyrography work with the laser work. I've been asked by somebody to make them uh, a bowl. Uh, this is a larger version of, of what we have here um, with a design like so. So my intention is to burn that onto the, onto the bowl. Um, so what I did, uh, I turned a couple of little, uh, little small uh, bowls in oak which we have a look at. One there and another one there. My intention is to uh, engrave on the outside and on the face of this one and on the face of this one. This is just a, a practice piece, what I've got here. The uh, piece I've been asked to, to do for somebody is approximately 250 in diameter. Uh, for that, I've ordered the new Autel Master 2. It's got a, a bed size of uh, capable of engraving on a piece 300 by 400 so i'm looking forward to get that through i'll go through step by step showing you how i'll get that onto
I hope you enjoyed that little demonstration. I just point out one of the little features that the uh, Auto Master One can do. Um, look forward to doing the next one for you. Coming up, next video is about the rotary roller. Doing another design of both edge and face. I'll show you how it's done. Speak to you soon. I do hope you enjoyed those videos um, as much as I enjoyed making them. This is the piece, obviously the uh, demonstration piece I need to make <clears throat> as I intend to make a, a larger piece when the uh, Otto Master 2 comes along. Another piece of quite a novel little piece it's for Father's Day. And I must have been doing the, uh, the engraving around the outside for something so thin it was somewhat uh, challenging but doable. You must make sure that when it's on the rotary roller the uh, all the edges are square so everything runs parallel to the machine itself. As I say, a few more, a few more times, um, a bit more experience I'm sure I'll get it spot on. Still, until next time, stay tuned, please subscribe, speak to you soon. Bye bye. Don't forget if you've got any comments any questions you want answered, I'll do my best to answer them for you. Just leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.